Yeah. And then Dapper, Metsonaris, and Jacob. So Metsonaris, the only EU representative here in this matchup, at least. It's kind of a weird team for him to be in, too. Jacob and Dapper have a very, like, keep the ball close, and if somebody tries to take it from them, they'll, like, you know, kind of, like, boom it away. Um, I feel like Metz's play style is a really different in he's that been, sense. He's been pretty quiet um, from what we've seen. Like, he's been contributing to the play, but he's not the guy up in the air making, like, awesome angles like well, Turbo has. Well, Metz is used to is he's used to like passing a lot down, having passing a lot. downfield, yeah, <laughs> and having either a lot of Mognus yeah. there to like redirect it in. So, yeah, it might not work so well with um, Dapper and Jacob in that right. regard. Mm -hmm. Jacob so. might be able to fill that pull. Yeah, That's definitely. True. Oh, you see the rotation uh, already uh, breaking down here for the team. Or they um, can all just overcommit. Yeah, so <laughs> or they can I, I only <laughs> really saw what. There's nobody. Oh, There's never mind. What, there where did the rotation go wrong? We couldn't really. I see. think Jacob I, thought Dapper was coming back quicker than he was. Because okay. you would never challenge that as a yeah. third man. Yeah, like, yeah, but why that. wasn't he coming back is my question. Shouldn't he have probably... Well, he was right, he was taking the back through that back boost. So Maybe he didn't have, he didn't a have boost nice deal, boost. you know? He could have gone for a boost deal. He's yeah. just, like, taking way too long. It's just, yeah. Probably was. He that hard hit and replay analysis. Right. Oh. Yeah, so, uh, you two were not on the couch. We had Sizz, and we we're talking to Sizz, and we're telling him, you know, if you don't win with this team, when right, exactly. I mean, you're, you're literally never going to win with this team. That's a true. That's you know, a he point. currently has not yet won a game. Um, I think if he through. doesn't win this, he but owes you a Red Bull, right? Yes. Did that that actually happen? Yeah, but they shook out on stream. There's proof. Someone, oh, wow. someone clipped it, I'm sure. Yeah. Can't lie if it's on footage. Well, the thing is, Turbo is now not playing. So yeah, and Turbo... This may open there's, up some windows. There's no Turbo, and he has Jane Apps and Garrett. So... Yeah, this Turbo is, has this the best the chance He should not be losing this. Well, JNAPS has a chance here. If he, if he wins every match with Garrett and Sizz, he'll be the new front runner and undefeated so far. Right, yeah. I mean, I think JNAPS is very strong in this format. Oh, and he, really, he really just fits into like any team. Uh, exactly. You know? it's it's so just give him the ball and he'll score it. Like, that's such a great you know, strength to have. Right. Although I'm, I'm hoping for some close games, I'm already one in five, so I'm not, I'm not, I'm not doing too hot right now. I don't want anybody getting to an early lead. I don't oh, want to know like I'd by next game it's too late. Been a goal. Uh, I mean, it was a kind of specific shot, and he ended up just missing it entirely. But I feel like that's going to happen with a lot of chances that um, red team is going to or orange team is going to get. Is that it has to be a good shot on net because like they're always going to have a goalie, and the goalie might not be positioned perfectly. But you still have to punish, like you know, that opportunity to score. Right. I, yeah. I mean, I expect the rotation from blue team to be pretty solid here, not making nearly as many massive mistakes as Orange team had. I mean, I, I could really see this game just staying at 1-0 the whole time. Yeah. All the games were. I think all the games have still been one-goal games. So. Yeah. On. Pretty much. I mean, the there was that one. A uh, game in the last series where there's a goal at one second and they get two oh, right. series, but that doesn't really count. The play's really, really cleaning up a little bit though from from Orange Team. Like it's kind of been back and forth on possession. Nobody's been caught, you know, yeah. running back super quickly and like having to make a last minute play. It's just been no one's really had possession longer than ten seconds. Right. Yeah, just one pretty blatant mistake coming out, looking to be the difference so far. Ooh, it's not the best touch. But... Yeah, at the moment it's pretty yeah. pretty safe Rocket League from all accounts. But I think Orange team needs to. They're gonna have to start pushing. They the just need to like like risk a double commit, for example. Like just keep going. Yeah, when they have a good level. opportunity. Just, yeah. Third uh, man, don't you don't have to wait so much. Oh, like, oh that's... Did he not have moves? I think mean, he just he didn't expect this. It, it was going so fast. I, I think he just misread how fast the ball was going. Uh, yeah. He also had pretty low boost. Yeah. Good positioning by Sizz though. He was he was already upfield, waiting for the boom. Yeah, he recognized exactly where that play was headed. I feel like off the bat for these teams, the blue teams like team dynamic is much better than the orange just on paper. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I think they're just proving it as well at this point. I think the but potential like... for big solo goals is big on orange team though. Yeah, they yeah. all are very strong. I mean. We saw some very good shots from Dapper in the first series. Oh yeah, he, he and here he is again. It. I think it, to, for a solo goal to work properly, they're going to need it's it like of all the teams to do it. This is probably some, a team who can do it. Not. I think I think if you boost starve, um, 
it, it, it could work. I just I just feel like orange team has been the ones who've been more boost starved than blue team. Yeah, blue team's just always there. They're coming with the next player. And it's hard to get boost when you're never first to the ball. Right. Yeah. Like boost starving requires some good team positioning. Yeah. So that because if you if you just like yeah, because if you miss one rotation, then yeah, yeah, yeah. it's all gone. Being your own teammate. The fact that blue are already holding position like pretty hard. Let you know up. Almost a chance. Be that ball was a little bit slower. Jacob could have made a play on it, but that's about as good of a chance as they've had this game, and that's not that strong of a chance. They're gonna need to put some more stuff together. Yeah, they had that chance to tie the game, and we, we could be going to overtime, perhaps. And maybe maybe blue team after getting scored on might you know change up their play a little bit. But if they're gonna sit there and hold the lead the whole time, not much is gonna change. Right. Ooh, a great oh, shot. Doing it for the fans. He had to do it for that. He just wants the own goal record, yeah, doesn't yeah, he? Yeah, I mean, he's up now. He's got two. Are we, are we, are we keeping count of this? Yeah, I think Jacob has two. Mystic has one. Yeah, that's Garrett it. Garrett might have like a half. Garrett one. has no, one. No, Garrett's a full one. Yeah, it was it a full, full one? one. Okay. If it's a deflection, it's hard. That was bouncing bar now. Yeah, yeah. Or, or posting out, sorry. That was definitely the most deliberate one we've seen. <laughs> that one was. Yeah, he'll tell something. you that. He'll tell you yeah. that. But. Yeah. <laughs> See, I think this game was uh, probably the first game where there was an outright better team, in my opinion. Yeah. He says he showed up. That's beyond. He was saying. If you can't win with these guys, then all hope was lost. But he, he showed up on right. the leaderboard there. It yeah, was well, just, you know, when you, your teammates are... Uh, yeah. <laughs> the E-League Cup champion and the X Game champion on your, the same team. Right. Yeah, they're just but playing against some Rocketeers. But there's an RCS yeah. Season 4 Grand, grand Finalist. finalist. <laughs> I saw Doomsie playing some drop shot <laughs> matches against the Grand Finalist there. He, I, he, he brought it back. It was close. He tied it was the close. game. He was 2-0 up, and then I came back. It was, yeah. It was, I think he's been practicing too much drop shot. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, uh, overall, I think blue team, just rotation-wise, like it, n all their goals weren't anything mm. fancy. It was, yeah. always, it was literally just solid rotations, normal stuff. I mean, they just killed them with in. consistency. Mm. Yeah, exactly you know? right. Orange team I mean, was both of their goals. Well, the first one was just a missed rotation. The second one was <laughs> sort of. Uh, he was like out of boost, couldn't make a play, but a lot of that stemmed from the fact that they were committed in the first place. So. Yeah, I, I just want to see Orange play maybe a little bit more reserved, like try to play what blue team's playing with the cons consistent rotations. A lot of the pass plays have been very telegraphed. They've been good passes, but very telegraphed right. passes. And it, instead of like rushing a play or going for a shot that's like a low percent play, they could just like give up possession and try to cut off the pass. Oh. And I'd like to see it a lot more. And I think the reason that that second goal went in was just that, that Jacob kind of rushed his defense. He could have waited for Sizz to take that shot. Yeah, it wasn't like absolutely. a fast shot. If he was in net for that shot, he would have saved it. Yeah. So I think just that confidence in their own ability to read uh, Blue Team's offense is going to give them the advantage. Yeah, that is a good point. I mean, Blue Team hasn't been doing anything that really throws you off. It's just been solid. So we have to focus on reading the play. So it's all about like they creating uh, the orange team like creating the opportunities for a pass a bit better. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it, it could happen off of just like they cut off one pass and that cutoff happens to go towards somebody who's like in midfield and then boom, yeah, you right. have I mean, a two on one. When you cut off a pass, the guy who's passed it is usually moving forward, and the guy who he's passing to, you're in front of now because he cut it off. That usually leaves one guy left. Yeah, you, you, you just roll your chances on getting a, a pass play cut off, and then you know. Hope you capitalize. Right. See already this game, it's a bit more back and forth. Yeah, they they finally punched through here. This is gonna this is a good chance. I, I've already seen Orange team perform way more yeah. passes oh, yeah. Yeah. without making. They're a lot more comfortable already. Yeah, yeah. That was a good pass by Jacob too. It, he made it pretty ambiguous whether he's gonna hit it forwards or towards mid, and then kind of flips oddly into it. Created a lot of space, but no finish. Mm -hmm. Oh, Ooh, good shot. Good, good shot there, but. Cleared out right to a defender, and now the blue team is just passing it down the field again. Yeah, all their touches are going to each other when they need them to, which is very important. They get it out of their zone very easily by doing so. Mm -hmm. Really good clear there from Jacob, though. It buys so much time, even though Dapper gets demoed. Like, Yeah, now Dapper has time to get some boost and get back in the play. They've had some potential for some big pass plays to the middle off of walls, but it just kind of like either rolls forward or rolls down, and it kind of kills the play. Like that. Yeah. Oh, good intercept there. Yeah, oh, like, we can see a fake. Oh, try to get time like, to maybe drift around it. I think so. It, it looked like he tried to go for some very strange, like, like a pinch. pinch on yeah, the ground, yeah. But that would have been amazing. It would have, yeah. There's something I always respect a player when 
you can shoot on goal, and if it is a very good shot, you will score. But then they just they think, okay, well, an easier option is to make some pass or delay right. the shot by going taking a different. Ooh, route. there it is. Just yeah, that's good. Clean pass cut pass play. Garrett's like, yeah, that's good. Garrett. Yeah, the that's celebration. Cool. Look at them all. Yeah. They're just so calm and relaxed. Just calm down, boys. Don't go too much. Just another day in the office. None of them need sound. <laughs> you can hear them from here. Oh, jeez. <laughs> they prefer to listen to our analysis. <laughs> yeah. Wait, analysis. Hold on. Yeah. Orange team started making their pass just a passes a little bit better after we talked about it. Yeah. Maybe. Uh, I, I really think maybe the orange team should start uh, double committing as much <laughs> as possible. <laughs> okay, oh well, is, well, 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 maybe that's not the best advice. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even see what happened. Either. I think like that was just oh, a really oh, good 50-50 and who? Wait, wait, he was Mets. <laughs> yeah. I think Mets went for. I don't know if he just whipped. I think Mets thought it was in. Jacobs? And it hit the post. Right. So he, he like smashed his face into the post and the ball just like rolled across the net. It just makes you look so stupid. When that <laughs> <laughs> Jacobs it's like, no, no, 50 if you do it on hard, but he didn't really have to like go so far like to the side of the ball, right? He could have gone into that. I feel like maybe there. he couldn't see JNAPs there. Oh, like, maybe. Cause, like uh, when you're in that position with ball came on, it really like messes with your field of view and somebody can come in out of nowhere with a ton of speed so he was like playing worst case scenario i think it was okay to do that i think i think Mets just could have cleared it yeah i mean it definitely shouldn't have led to the goal but uh oh this that's a good that's a good cutoff from jacob it passes the middle but it was very high job. and there's only one player coming in so they could create a pass play off of it so i think there was a good one yeah a lot of a lot of these uh, challenges are just going the way of blue team. Like they'll challenge, they'll win the challenge, and they still have ball possession. Well, that's the thing. You got to every challenge you make has to have an intention of you know where it's going to be. Mm -hmm. So many so many players just right. they're Either like they're so focused on winning, and a win doesn't necessarily mean towards their heart. In fact, most often they're like a winning a 50-50 is just better to go a bit more towards your center. Yeah, assuming I, you're not a third man. Oftentimes. It's the best case scenario for you is you actually sort of get beat and it goes back to your team. Yeah, exactly. You set up possession. It's sort of similar with a clear. It's like, you can get a great clear, but at the end of the day, if it just goes straight into their half and then they just boom it back, you kind of, you right. may have bought a little bit more time. You bought like but five seconds. Yeah. But at the same time, you've kind of bought time for the other team to right. maybe it's get their boost. Right, if you're getting boost starved or something, but you don't want to be doing that. Like if they're boost starved, you, you yeah, exactly, yeah. yeah. You know, just more solid gameplay. Oh, oh this is open. open. Yeah. This is the one v one. That's a dapper yeah. play. Yeah. Dapper. That's a dapper play. The dapper special. Very nice. I really did overcommit too. Oh yeah. I mean, I don't think that should have. Was that Sis? I think that was yeah. Sis. I, I probably should not have challenged there. Made dapper take it slow. Just a, a fake challenge there goes yeah. a long yeah. way. Yeah, yeah. Pretend you're going to challenge so that he can't just drive super fast. Shadow definitely. defense. Yep. Shadow yeah. defense. Shadow defense. Probably the most under. Appreciated skill in Rocket League. Or the most useful. Anyone who finds himself in, as a third man a lot needs to be very good at it. That's, your, that's literally a role. That is your first priority. Yeah. So like, that, that's a third man, you're buying time. Yeah. That is what you're supposed to be doing. Yeah, because if you're trying to make a solo contest when you could have bought time for a teammate to make a contest, like, do you want a 1v1 or a 1v2? Oh, so. redirect. Oh, this kind of could be, it's, this could be a chance. A two on one. I think. It's oh, it's just too high. Uh, mm, I think it's too high for Jacob. Yeah. Unfortunately, they're gonna be able to kill it. Yeah. Oh, they're going for the goal. Oh, that last one could have been a goal. Yeah, I mean, a in a three v one, you can definitely delay that. And that was, I would like to see him just extension. like carry it and then maybe do a single pop and then go for the demo on the goalie mm -hmm. instead of trying to flick mm -hmm. it towards Mets. Yeah, that's a very tricky. Well, thanks. So you have two other people as well. You both go for demo. Basically, one could go for a demo. One's yeah. going for a pass, and then you can either just wait. You basically just wait. You just wait and see if it goes see, in. Yeah. Right? See, and you can go send two people for the demo because usually the goalie will try to jump over somebody. So <laughs> the first guy doesn't jump to counter the yeah. defensive jump. The second guy sees if the first guy jumps and then jumps at him. <laughs> yeah. And then their guy scores it. That's pretty clever. I didn't think of that. But that's pretty good. They probably there. just thought that they're going to get challenged from behind earlier, I guess. Yeah, I maybe. Because you wouldn't play it that fast if you know you have time, right? Mm. Well, Sometimes the ball can come away from you. I don't know. It could also be a mechanical thing. That's true. Like if you just caught ahead and you're like, ah. Yeah. Especially if you have zero <laughs> boost or something. You're like, oh, for God's sake, <laughs> it's running away from me. Yeah. And then you start boosting faster and faster. <laughs> it's like, now you just stop. Yeah. <laughs> just go on the other side of the ball. You can't. This game can be frustrating. Yeah. He needs more dribbling challenge. He needs yeah. more practice at. He needs more tornado flicks. 
That's what you gotta do. I don't know. Jacob's in a dominance. If he tried to tornado flick that, that might go like off the backboard <laughs> in his own net. It might go off the ceiling and then in the goal. Yeah, yeah tornado flick from your own net and then it might go in. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, that, uh, that game was a lot closer. So there's still hope. I yeah. definitely still see it. I could see I, Orange I, team I, I, I could see game. a win. Oh, there was a chance for a redirect there. I mean, blue team, towards the end, there was showing some signs of overextension. Their one goal was an overextension. They almost got scored on the end. I think they're just. They're, Kind of getting a little bit too comfortable playing against this team. They're like, oh yeah, we, we can get away with this or that here or there. And if you know, red team picks up the pa or orange team picks up the pace just a little bit, they're gonna get punished for it more. When in game one, they really weren't punished for any of it. Yeah, absolutely. There's very little happening for orange team in game one. So if they continue the upward trajectory, this could be their game. I think them scoring first would also be a huge benefit. Oh, oh that's, that's, a, that's a great bomb as well. <laughs> yeah, great bomb. What, great job by JNAPS controlling it, hitting it up so that he, not only did he have a chance to go after it again, he also gave himself a lot of space to do a lot of different things with the ball. Mm -hmm. With the way he popped it up, he could have passed it mid or he could have taken the shot. He sees the bump, just goes to the shot. Yeah, Good he gave himself so many options. Yeah, very, very well played. I mean, it's easy for Sizz to, you know, win all these games if he just bumps the goalie and then tells JNAPS to shoot the ball. <laughs> It'll definitely go on net. Yeah. yeah have you guys noticed an in increase in bump meta over in North America? Yeah. It's yeah. like, it's yeah, I like better it. all the time. Just everyone bumps now. And oh, it's yeah. so effective. That's, I'm pretty sure that's how we won like all of our season four RLCS League play games. <laughs> we just bumped everybody. Yeah. But some people go way now. out and cut off their rotations to do it. Yeah, I and mean, like, there's definitely some bump plays that are really bad, but people don't expect them, so you actually get the bump. <laughs> but like, if the person actually jumped over you, it would have been so Ooh, bad. Ooh, another oh, bump. Oh, he's got it. Telling you, it's the bump plays. I feel like the, the the bump did happen, but it was more of a misplay from. Uh, well, there was a little oh, bit of bumping. That was actually he got it yeah. twice. I didn't see the first bump. Yeah, because yeah. I was like, why why is Jnap so far up right. for this and mid pass? The worst part about that bump too is his front wheel was still on the ground, his back wheel weren't, so he just like kind of wobbled forward, and then he couldn't get around to it. Mm. Oh, even Stevens now. Oh, the goal oh, for that. Another chance. Oh. Jacob's ready. No, he's not. Ready. Back today. Oh! Okay. More well game plays. A good oh. way to stop those solo plays is to like, have somebody from the side come in where the uh, the dribbler can't see them coming. Right. And then even if they flick it, the person, the other person who didn't challenge is back towards the net so they can clean up anything. I might just. Oh, wow. I don't want to just. I don't right think, think Jake can buy that for a second. Good attempted fake. They're definitely focused on just keeping possession. I think if blue team just has more possession, that they'll get more chances than the orange team will. Yeah. It's, yeah. They're just a lot better at creating these opportunities for a potential yeah. pass or a potential shot. I feel like orange though is slowly Ooh, coming alive. Like there, yeah, there, there is. That's a good pass. It's very hard very pass good transition the here. They. What yeah, all, like all, all three, three of them are right right back in the same direction. Bad. You should never all be in the same corner. Pretty much under any circumstance, right? There's yeah. literally That's a good zero tip. circumstances in Rocket League with that shot. Yeah. And it happens. It actually, that is all one that's thing cool. that I think is worth pointing out. If your teammate 50s it in the corner on the offensive zone, it's very tempting to go in and clean it up, but it's such a waste because there's only one person left, and you're not going to get something where they can score on their own. Yeah, because he's in the third man. Right. So he's, he's not going to go yeah. challenge on their backboard. Yeah. The only way he would go for it is if the goal was like open or right. like it's just the best pass, and so he yeah. can get he can definitely get that first. So if the other team's set, you should not follow your teammate in the corner, yeah. even if it's kind of stuck there. It's just not worth it. Well, that's why the third man should be behind the guy in the corner. Right. So then like, when it's out. Yeah. 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 Really awkward bounce for Mets. I mean, he, Sizz just had a perfect placement on this, clear. Mets has no idea if it's rolling or if it's bouncing. And it did, really it did the bounce. roll, then the bounce. Yeah, where it comes down off the corner, like hits kind of twice and then pops out. That one is so hard to read because you go up the back wall for it and then you have to get out for it all of a sudden. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's... Still two minutes left. I mean, we're back to being tied. It looked like Orange Team was really coming alive with these passing plays, and then after they, they got a pass play goal, it just, like, stopped. Yeah. Well, this could be a drop. Oh, not the play. That's the idea, though. Yeah, Jacob's accuracy has been not insanely high. Oh, no. 
That's, that's, that's a, a double, and he has a double free No, oh. not my god! <laughs> and who else? Oh, sis. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? I really hope that, that could be the nugget that ruins the captaincy. <laughs> <laughs> you need that nugget, all the nuggets you can yeah. get. I was, I was just about to say as well, like the blue team have been, <laughs> like their goals have been like just accurate and not necessarily a mistake from the orange team. Whereas the other way, orange like have been scored more to more mistakes than we. Oh, oh wow. definitely think it was in. in. Yeah, I didn't think it was in. Yeah, neither did I. That just. He just wins over Metsa. Wow. It slowly it still doesn't look like it's in. Exactly. <laughs> it curved in. What the heck? That's crazy. Squeezing it in. Well, now Orange Team has to put something together. They have one minute. They they have showed much more signs of life. They've you know created more space for themselves this game. But now the blue team knows they only have to go without being scored on for one minute. I don't think we're going to see them all in the same corner again. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, he just kept backing up, but we definitely wanted someone else to take that ball. Yeah. See, he was even buying time Ooh, on his own okay. goal line. That's and he's going to reverse right, air dribble. Here we go. The death right, special. Not. Uh, Ooh. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh, he pre-jumped it. Yeah. He, wasn't, <laughs> he wasn't ready. The pre-jump. Well, no, maybe not a pre-jump. I he think it's because he didn't expect the, sec the next yeah. touch. Yeah, so he didn't like, see the flip. Yeah. Got a player up? Uh, not quite. Jacob's still there. Yeah, it's, it still works. Mm, nah, that's definitely it. I might go in. Is Jacob gonna own goal for the fans again? That's could have the boot. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> ceiling, ceiling pass? Ceiling. Oh. Wow. Close. Right, that's, that's a 3 0. 3 0. Close games, though. We, we almost saw one team. Got, it got close. Wake up. The first, team, the first game was not very <laughs> close. <laughs> yeah, game from Sizz. <laughs> but they, they pulled it together, and Sizz actually. Going to a 50% record. That's good. Um, good for him. Not going to have JNAPS and Garrett on his team every series, though. So, no, it's good that he's. I think uh, the next matchup for Sis, he's got Jacob and Turbo Pulsa, which almost might be on the same level, but 